people of the internet and welcome back to Back to the Future. Um, it's actually the next day and I thought um, might as well I have some spare time just to do, uh, no, not do, uh, record another video. So that's what I'm doing now. So yeah, um, hope you enjoy, you know what to do. Um, and yeah, that, that was... That was a really good intro. That was the best intro ever. Yeah, you know. Okay, um, let's move on. Um, we've talked to her. Um, I actually forgot what was I was about to do. Quick, there went, there went Jennifer into the alley. Oh, oh, I, yeah. I already talked to her. You really should talk to Jennifer in the alley. I've already talked to. Her. Do I have to talk to her again? What is it now? You're going out with someone else. I bet I can make you. Sorry, Martin, but you just don't rate. No, I've only talked to. Ah. I don't understand. Give me a can of spray paint. I got an urge to paint something. Happy little <laughs> trees. Get yourself a. Hey. Um. Jennifer is in the alley behind the... Yeah, I'm I'm right there too. Yeah, just walk around the back and talk to her. Are you probably done that? Um. Oh, you've forgot these newspapers. Um, I don't know what to do. It says talk to her, but... I've already done that. I'm confused. Yeah? You going out with someone else? I bet I can make you forget. Sorry, Martin, but you just don't... Yeah, there's no way the options. You going out with someone else? Sorry, Martin. Your paint star... Ah! There is no other options. I do, I do I have to search here? Do I just search? That junk looks awfully familiar. Fifty years familiar. I don't want to go digging through the trash unless I absolutely have to. Well, you have to, because I have no idea what to do. Um, mm. That leads to the soup, Mo. Leech is in there. I'd rather he come out here. Oh, okay. Right, um... Locked doorway, yeah. It bricked up the entrance to the old speakeasy. <laughs> yes. Who gave you permission to knock on my door? Um, I don't know. Lego my ego or something? <laughs> the answer was? I, I don't know. No, the door one was Doris Day, wasn't it? Yeah. I think. I can't remember. <laughs> okay, this is different. Look out, son! Ooh. Was that mother? That's mother. Mom? Mom. 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 Yes, mom. She's gone. Where's she go? Mom? Oh, hey, mom. Mom. Mom? Mom! Mom! But are you happy? <laughs> Happiness is overrated, Mom. Lorraine. I'm like content. Five times. Well, Answer me, bitch. I'll think about it. <laughs> Mom? Hi there, Martin. I saw you as I was driving in. Did you hear me honking? Mom, that can't be you. Martin, are you alright? I'm, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> it's just that you're so, so gray. Well, isn't that an uplifting way to greet your mother? Sorry, I just don't... I guess you're right, though. I am going a little gray. No thanks to your father. Hmm. Um... So, what? Are you out here shopping or something? Oh, shopping? <laughs> Who shops anymore? No, it's that time of the month for me again. Uh... For my civic duty. I'll be polishing the statue all day. Oh, right. Um, who's golf cart? What's with the golf cart, Mom? Now, Martin, I know you're embarrassed to be driving around in last year's model, but we really can't afford the 86s yet. 
What about my truck? No one owns a truck in Hill Valley. Martin, are you sure you're feeling okay? Yeah, yeah. I just... I must have had a really vivid dream last night. Well, I hope your dream world was more fun than this one. Oh, Who it is. Yeah, I forgot is. to give your father my timesheet for last week, and now Mr. Nosy is convinced that I'm hiding something from him. Timesheet? Aren't they annoying? But Citizen Brown always says, a scheduled life is a happy life. Anywho, could you be a dear and drop it off at the house? Here, take the car. Actually, I... I know, uh... I know, dear. Love you, too. I'd give you a kiss, but you know what that gets you. Don't forget <laughs> to pick me up this evening. It gets you a demerit. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. Um... I'll be right back, guys. Alright, okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, my window was open, and um, there were cars passing. And I didn't want the noise to, um, the noise to interrupt the video. Okay, um, what do I do, what do I do? Nobody seems to have anything else to say to you here. Oh yeah, I remember. Go get the car and drive home and do something. Well, it's not the truck, but I guess it'll do. I'm home. <laughs> I don't know, John. Isn't this illegal? What isn't illegal in Hill Valley? What's the door with caution things on it? Don't worry, nobody can see us here. He's a peeping Tom. Ah. <laughs> Dad, try to warn your old man the next time, okay? Sure. Yeah, here you got hit with some more demerit, Nathan. Good on you, I say. Sure. Never trust the guy with him. Um, I saw Mom downtown. She told me to give this to you. Thanks. Say, uh, what gives around here? Ah, uh, you know, the usual. Keeping tabs on Hill Valley through my trusty bank of monitors. Always on the lookout for some interesting footage. Oh, yeah? Interesting. What do you mean, interesting? What kind of silly question is that? I've been gathering candid documentary footage for Citizen Brown's promotional videos for over a year now. I know your mother doesn't approve of my work, but... Wait a minute. You say you saw Lorraine? 11 to 12 hair salon, 12 to 12 20 lunch at soup mo counter, cream of asparagus with crackers... What was that? You know your mother's problems. If she slips up again, it could mean demerits for the whole family. There Come she on. is, polishing the statue in the park. Just like the schedule dictates. Oh, then everything's fine. Good. Unless... How was she when you spoke to her? Lucid? Sober? Yes. Um... I'm not going to rattle, ma'am. You've been overbearing. Whoa, Dad, what are you telling me? Are you saying Mom's a drunk? Shh, I don't know for sure that your mother is relapsed into her old ways, but she's been acting very odd lately, almost as if she didn't like my constant supervision. Confidentially, I suspect she's got a flask hidden somewhere. Probably I don't think anybody would like to be where she's working on. right now. Do to me a honest. favor, son, will you? See if you can worm the truth out of her. She won't confide in me, but she may be less guarded with you. Double rations this week if you help your old man out. What do you say? That's a good boy. Okay, Dad, we need to talk. Yes. What were you hiding when I came in just now? Hiding? I don't know what you're talking about, son. Come on, I saw it. It was a videotape, right? Um... I might as well tell you. After all, you'll be 18 soon. Tell me what? <laughs> Hill Valley under Citizen Brown. It's not quite the contented town you were led to believe it was. No way, I don't believe it. No way. 
This isn't a criticism of the great man himself, of course, or his sainted wife, Edna. No one's worked harder than they wife. to apply the most advanced social planning techniques you know, to our <laughs> municipality. But... What? Confidentially, not everybody appreciates it. A great many citizens, perhaps even the majority, actively resent the Brown administration. They don't say so publicly, of course. But in private? Well, just listen. I tell you, Bert, this regime is a joke. They're all laughing at us over in Fairfax. A toast to Citizen Brown. May his beloved courthouse be struck by lightning. <laughs> Good on. You're awful. Are you coming to the town square, Lester? Citizen Brown's about to give another speech. Citizen Brown can kiss my hairy... Well, you get the idea. Uh, it sounds like people can't stand what the Browns have done to Hill Valley. Not everyone. Only around 50%, maybe 60. Does Citizen Brown know? He should. Whenever I send copies of my raw footage to the public relations department over at the courthouse, I get a memo telling me how much Citizen Brown thanks me for my service. But how could he see those videos and not do anything about it? Maybe you should take your tapes directly to Brown. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, sure, he might appreciate my bringing these problems to his attention and reward me for my public service, but then again, they say it's never wise to be the bearer of bad news. All right, uh, I'll take the tape. Why don't you give me those videotapes? I'll take them to Citizen Brown. Thanks for offering, son, but I don't want to get you involved. Citizen Brown won't like what he sees on them, and I wouldn't want you to get the brunt of his displeasure. Not to mention the displeasure of all the folks on the tapes. Once they find out I recorded them... No, I'm not letting these tapes out of my sight. It's too dangerous. <sighs> it's about me. I'm all ears. Okay, this conversation does not make sense. Um... Well, I... Uh... From certain things I've heard, I, I get the idea that people in this town regard Marty McFly as a... As a what? A nerd. They said that? In so yeah, many words. they did. Just because a boy studies hard and gets straight A's and respects the rules and doesn't party or drink or stay out late and is perhaps a bit socially inept and obsessed with personal hygiene and prefers his rubber band collection Stop. to... I really don't want to hear anymore. I'm proud of you, son. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Where can I find me? I'm trying to understand why Jennifer broke up with me in this time. Uh, you recent past. Are you still mooning over that girl? Forget her! She's bad news. Why my surveillance cameras have caught her doing things that, that are completely against the Hill Valley Code. I don't want to know. Kissing boys. Sitting with boys in cars. I've kept quiet about it for her father's sake, but believe me, you're well rid of her. You, uh, is there anywhere you expect me to be, like, right now? Well, I did expect you to be up at the lake until tomorrow with that math and magic competition, so I guess your time is pretty much your own right now. Mathematic competition? Okay, different Won't subject. Catch me with that. Yeah. <laughs> I hate maths. I don't like maths. It's about mom. How'd she get to be such a mess? This isn't how she is in my in my perfect world. You're right. It's a real puzzle because, of course, we both know Hill Valley is a perfect world. But for some peculiar reason, the harder I try to get her to conform to the rules, the more she slips up. All right. Um, she's considering Citizen Plus. She's thinking about signing up for the Citizen Plus program. Is she now? You, you're not going to let her go through with it, are you? Well, from what I hear, it's a fairly drastic procedure which completely reshapes the subject's personality. On the other hand, if Citizen Brown recommends it, it's got to be a good thing. Sorry, guys got interrupted again. I every time I want to record a video, I always get uh Get, no, I always get interrupted halfway through, which is just annoying. I should have a sign like outside, you know, uh, recording in progress or something. Ugh. Okay, where were we? Um, Don't you think Mom would be a little more relaxed if you gave her just a little bit of space? Now, there's a fine suggestion. What would Hill Valley be like if people gave each other space? Why we 
we'd all be tempted to follow our own impulses, and there's no telling where that might lead. Hmm. Something on your mind? Um, ask about you. So about you <laughs> and your, uh, work. Shoot. You seem to How be really like into this <laughs> spying business. It's not spying, son. It's cinema verite. These candid moments of Hill Valley's residents will eventually be compiled and edited into the documentaries and promotional materials that advertise our way of life to the rest of the world. True, you can argue that I've taken things to extremes, but I still get up to take mm -hmm. my meals and, of course, to use the facilities. <laughs> You're supposed to be... I mean, wouldn't you rather spend your time writing, say, science fiction novels? Science fiction... I did mess around with it once, but that was before Citizen Brown made it illegal. Science illegal. fiction's illegal? Sci-fi promotes an unhealthy obsession with the fantastic and impossible, and it encourages the idea that there might be better societies than Hill Valley, which is subversive nonsense, of course. <laughs> uh, okay, science different fiction subject. illegal? Yeah. Bubblegum illegal? What? <laughs> What? Uh, um, I suppose someone it's we both about know. someone we both know. <laughs> yes? Yeah, about Biff. Have you seen Biff lately? Not since he went to the reconditioning center. Is he back among the living? Depends on what you mean by living. He's really different from the way I remember him. Lucky dog. In a way, it isn't fair that Hill Valley's biggest scofflaw should be the first to receive the benefits of the new Citizens Plus program. But I know I shouldn't be jealous. Have you ever spent time with Citizen Brown? Well, of course I'm in the audience for every one of his public addresses. One-on-one, -on -one, I mean. Oh, no. He'd never notice a common Sector L citizen like me. But I dream that someday he'll recognize me for my public service, and maybe let me shake his hand. Oh, it'd not be a dream come true. <laughs> um, tell me about Edna. Okay. What can you tell me about Edna? Mrs. Citizen Brown? Oh, she's a wonderful woman. People just think of her as this sweet, self-effacing, grandmotherly type. Edna? Are we talking about the same? But really, she's just as involved in running the town as her husband is. Yes. <laughs> We're talking about the same person. <laughs> Tell me about my brother and sister. Uh, David and Linda. Have you heard from them? No, I thought maybe you had. <sighs> Not in ages. As far as I know, he's still working for the big city newspaper, and she's still in that women's boarding house. I'll never understand why they decided to leave Hill Valley. Oh, I have a pretty good idea, yeah. Hmm. Something hmm. on your mind? Hill Valley has a lot of rules. It certainly does, for our own good. Public kissing is illegal, right? Ah, the old PDA law. Indeed it is. And what's more, violation carries a hefty load of demerits. But you know, it's a law people break with surprising regularity. But I could show you videotaped evidence. How exactly do people get other people to break it? On second thought, perhaps I shouldn't show you the videotaped evidence. Ah. If I got caught with a contraband item, I'd get in a lot of trouble, right? You certainly would. You could be facing up to a thousand demerits, depending on the item. But of course, you wouldn't be caught dead with anything illegal. It's your mother I'm worried about. <laughs> Did you ever harbor a dangerous animal? Ha ha! Couldn't if I wanted to. They've all been banned. But I did catch something very interesting on one of my monitors yesterday. Which one was it? Oh, yes. Does that look like a stray dog to you? Whatever it is, Edna's Animal Patrol will make short work of it. That's Einstein. Yeah, I was, I was wondering where, where uh, he went. Uh, do we have a dog? Different subject. Hmm. Something on your mind? Um... What's the deal with the house, Dad? I don't know how to tell you this, son. But while you were away at your mathematic competition, our house got slapped with a CZ-36 violation. What? 
I know, Stop. it's so embarrassing. Your mother's mortified. She works so hard to keep a clean house, but those dust mites are so hard to keep down. Wait a minute, we can't go into the house because of dust mites? Well, not until they send in the cleanup crew. This is ridiculous. Thank goodness they let me move my office out here into the garage. <laughs> so, uh, when is this dust mite problem gonna be solved so I can get to all my stuff? Well, the cleanup crew said they'd probably get around to it by tonight, but they're kind of backed up, so I wouldn't expect them until tomorrow morning. Tomorrow? Uh, where am I supposed to sleep? I got it all covered, son. We're gonna camp out back just like we did when you were little. Okay, this timeline is officially a nightmare. <laughs> um... How exactly does this setup work? <laughs> I'm glad to see you taking an interest. Each of these monitors is connected to multiple cameras, of which I've strategically jacked into throughout the valley, with official clearance, of course. I can switch between cameras with these buttons. There's also a VCR for each monitor. I keep a record of everything I see. So, if I happen across something intriguing, I can keep it on file. Wow, so interesting. Well, I'll leave you to your snooping. Supervising, son. Supervising. I'll leave you to it. Right. Another day in Valley. Okay, um, break some rules. You can start by finding Lorraine's secret stash. Okay. It's in this cupboard. Uh, oh, Marty's guitar. Hey, what's my guitar doing out here? Your mother and I convinced you to give it up, remember? Give it Rock up! Rock and roll music is frowned on by the Brown administration. It sets a poor example for all the kids who look up to you as a model of studiousness and moral gravity. And besides... You're not very good. Oh, thanks. Come on, Dad. I need that guitar. Give me one good reason why I should give it back to you. Because... Because it's mine. <laughs> well, it's not mine. It's his. But you get the point. Um... Music is good for you. It improves your mental performance. Then take up the piccolo. Leave the electric guitar to the rebels and malcontents. No. A certain <laughs> girl is only going to like me if I can play the guitar. A certain girl? You don't mean... Jennifer. Oh, Martin. Why are you fixated on that little hellion? She's nothing but trouble. Yeah, my kind of trouble. And besides, the way you play guitar, you're only going to drive her further Oh. Go ahead, son. Do your worst. Thanks, Dad. Well, hey. Good it's morning, mine. Mrs. Brown. Is that that? Me as Mrs. Citizen Brown. Oh, Mr. Mrs. Citizen Brown. Okay. Um, what well, can I click I, on? I so hard to get that type. Can't click on anything else. Oh, floppy disks. Greetings, programs. LeBrock 2.0. Anatomical constructs for sciences of all sorts. <laughs> Boring. What am I doing here? Um, I'm just looking at the monitors, okay. Okay, um, head scan. Might be hiding something. She might open up if she had a little proof. Oh, okay. Right, okay. Oh. the hell? Don't violate the perimeter, son! Good morning, Mrs. Brown. Please... Well, sorry for trying to walk into my own house. I'm sorry, Mrs. Brown. It's just a thing. Um, I, I so how so do I... Get... I think I have to talk to her, don't I? Oh, spinal lane with that camera by the statue. If only you could... Oh, okay. Yeah, I have to go back. I have to go back. Okay, how do I go back? Where did I park the car? No, oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, 
So I have to block a camera. Where is it? Um, oh, I know how. Use this then, yeah. Can I not do that? Oh. Let's try talking to us Mom? first. What about you, Mom? What about me? What are you doing out here polishing the statue? I know. I was scheduled to clean the clock this month, but then Needle's mom ate some of that bad tofu that's been going around. So there was some reshuffling in the L Sector duty roster, and here I am. Uh, I, I kind of wish I was cleaning the clock, though. So much nicer up there without all the cameras. The cameras? Oh, I bet, yeah. Wave to Big Brother. Or big husband in this case. Hmm. I saw you talking to Biff about the Citizen Plus program. Biff says I'd be a perfect candidate for it. I know Biff, don't and do if it. that's <laughs> what the Citizen Plus program does to people, then you don't want any part of it. But Biff has been reformed. Look at him. He seems so happy now. So at peace with this town. What I wouldn't give. He's a total <laughs> veg, Mom. Your father is always telling me that I don't invest enough in the workings of our great citizen Brown. Maybe it's time for me to turn a new leaf and just go with the flow. Okay, just hold off for a bit, please. I don't want you doing anything rash. <laughs> all right, all right, let's talk about something else. All righty, dear. Yeah, so I'm gonna Mom, are you list again? drinking again? Don't be silly, dear. Booze is illegal, you know. Yeah, Mom. It's just that Dad mentioned... Your father. Why, I just can't get away from his prying eyes. Always spying. Always watching. You... You mind your own business, George! Now, Lorraine, this is for your own good. I know you're keeping a secret from me. It's mine to keep. <laughs> Dad! Mom! Knock it off, you two! Now, you listen here, young man. This is an adult matter between your mother and me. Dad, I know, but your way isn't working. You gotta give her some space here. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! What uh, is that in your bad. hand? <laughs> Rum? Gin? A wine cooler? For your information, it's brass cleaner. I have a job to do here, you know. Lorraine? No! Lorraine, I'm just trying to look out for you. You know the kind of trouble we can get into if you're drinking again. George, I wouldn't be so on edge if you weren't suffocating me all the time. Stop it, Is that an admission? An admission of how smothered I am by you? Okay. You guys finished? Right. <laughs> Mom? So I've got a list to get through. I'm having a bad day, Mom. Can I ask you a few things? We all have our share, son. I, uh, lost my timesheet. What have I got going on this week? Well, Monday is Junior Brown Brigade. Junior oh, what now? And Tuesday is Model UN. Oh, God. Model UN? Mm-hmm. You represent Djibouti. On Wednesday, you'll be oh, overseeing Djibouti. the board game club at the Rex Okay, Center. okay, board I've games. heard enough. Oh, God. I saw Jennifer earlier today. Oh, Jennifer. What a spunky gal. Are you two patching things up? She totally blew me off. He well, wishes. I'm not the world's biggest dating expert, seeing as how I married the first guy to fall from the sky. But maybe you should spend a little less time with your microscopes and ant farms, and a little more time tending to her needs. What kind of things is she passionate about, Martin? What are her interests? I don't uh, even the know complete anymore. opposite of Citizen yes, Brown world. <laughs> um, when did I become so square? Everyone is treating me like some sort of goody two shoes, Mom. They're just jealous that you're such a perfect citizen of Hill Valley. Have I always been this way? Always been a perfect little son? Going on 18 years now. <laughs> what about that time I said fire to the living room? Oh, but you only did that so you could show us the fire retardant you made with your chemistry set. Heavy. <laughs> all right, all right, let's talk about something else. All righty, dear. Um, I've asked about flask, I've asked about dad. So, what's up with dad? Uh, indeed. What is up with him? The 
that setup in his garage is pretty intense. My timer says I've got another four More and a half like minutes. Creepy. I heard that. <laughs> okay, um... I feel like I don't know anybody anymore. Well, Martin, that could be a sign you need to get out more. I'm outside right now. <laughs> um, Is there Brown. any way I could talk to Citizen Brown? Oh, you know how difficult that is, Martin. The great man spends so much time coming up with new rules and demerits that he barely has time to talk to us anymore. I guess that's the price we pay for a safe, happy city. So he doesn't see anyone? Not unless someone starts rolling up the demerits. He still takes a personal interest in those right, situations. Yes, um, hmm. the objective and of was to you talk to Mrs. Rules. Brown. Clara? No, silly. Yes. Edna. Edna Strickland? Mm hmm. Yeah. Wait, wait, Doc. Uh, Citizen Brown is married to Edna Strickland? Did you get a bump on the head or something? They've been happily married for nearly 40 years. In fact, if you ask me, I think Edna wears the pants in the relationship. She's the one always announcing the day-to-day -day bulletins. Probably writes them herself. <laughs> I need to Probably, sit down. Probably, yeah. We talked about Biff. Um, what's the back? Jen's dad doesn't seem to like me very much. He's just a little stressed out, dear. Filling the crime-stomping shoes of his legendary father makes poor Danny Jr. a little twitchy. <laughs> so I see. But he gets the job done. Between him and his father, Hill Valley's been as dry as the Sahara Desert for decades now. Unfortunately. Dry? Doc was right. We did overdo it. <laughs> what do you Talk think of Jennifer, him. Mom? Well, she certainly looked like quite a handful, dear. I was really hoping some of her, uh, joie de vie would have rubbed off on you. What do you mean by that? Well, Martin, you can be a little uptight sometimes. Jeez, don't sugarcoat it, Mom. Well, maybe you needed to hear it. There's nothing wrong with having priorities in life. Just maybe Jennifer should have been a little higher on your list. Yeah, she should. Well, you did buy that guitar. That's a step in the right direction. Women love musicians. Oh, Just yes. keep practicing and I'm sure so you'll get better. So I to get spray paint. talking about? I'm a great musician. To spray paint something. That's the spirit. Yes. I've just got that idea. <laughs> alright, alright, let's talk about something else. Alrighty, dear. Um... Is it just me, or does Hill Valley feel really strict today? Some might even call it stifling. But you didn't hear that from me. Uh, okay, I'm... I'm done with this conversation. Uh, can I exit this conversation? Oh, alright, alright, let's talk about something else. Alrighty, dear. Right. Okay. Um. So my current goal: break some rules. You can start by finding my secret stash. Right. Okay. Oh yeah, I was trying to hide the cameras and stuff. Wasn't I? And how do I do that? Problem, citizen. Uh, everything's perfectly all right now. We're uh, we're fine. We're all fine now. Thank you. Uh, how are you? <laughs> um. Yeah, I, I I knew that. I knew that, yeah. But how do I statue? Oh I just click on the statue. Okay. Okay, now what? Oh he's not blocked. Push it some more. So that was my timer, yes, uh, it's blocked. What happened? What the heck am I looking at? Yes! Where's she gone? Where's she gone? Where's she gone? Where's she gone? What's she doing? What are you doing? 
Doing some illegal stuff. Yes, she is. Mom, now the dad isn't watching. Oh, Martin. Uh, <clears throat> Was that a flask, Mom? Flask? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I, I... Look, it's okay, Mom. Get a hold of yourself. Oh, your father's right. I'm backsliding. But it's been so hard, what with your brother and sister leaving, and then your father getting obsessed with his monitors and... <laughs> oh, it's okay. Let me take cry. care of the flask. Dad doesn't we'll have to know anything timeline. about it. <laughs> oh, thank you, sweetheart. I couldn't bear the thought of facing your father over this. Now, grab the flask. Grab it. Here's my flask. This timeline sucks. Mom and Dad are fighting again. Mom's drinking. It's like everything Doc and I ever did to fix things is falling apart. Time to get some attention. Yes, it is. Um, God. This video has been... Um... Go talk to him. Okay. Yeah, this video has been um, mostly dialogue. <laughs> um, that's why I'm carrying on. Hands up, it citizen. Bit. Assume the position. Here goes nothing. There better be apple juice in this. Well, um. Why don't you open it and find out? Don't get smart with me. Uh, I knew you were no good, McFly. Officer Parker, no, what no. seems to be the problem here? Citizen McFly, ma'am. Came strolling up with a 181B violation in his pocket. Ugh. You, young citizen, where did you get that? That booze? Nowhere. Is he being smart with me? Yeah, he played that attitude on me as well. Can we just fast forward the lecture and just get this over with already? No! Officer, demerit him severely. And as for the alcohol, drop it into the decycling bin. With pleasure, ma'am. God, loosen up, people. <laughs> now, keep your nose clean, or you'll find yourself in front of Citizen Brown. Yes, that's, that, that's, that's the whole point, yes. Um, break some rules, you can try making some friends with this straight, straight dog. Oh, straight dog, is he over here? Where's straight dog? Where's Einstein? Einstein? Really? I can't walk that way. Um, okay, let's go back to the alleyway. Oh, where's she going? She in paint? Yeah. Ammo box. Must be where Jen keeps her paints. Locked. God damn it, why is it has to be locked? She missed a spot. <laughs> I don't want to go digging through the trash unless I absolutely have. Okay, you said that. Yeah. Okay. I'm uh, just checking if there's anything new. Now, she went over here. That leads to the soup mo. Leech is in there. I'd rather he come out here. Right, you want them to come out here, okay, right, um, oh, this way, there's a waste of time coming here, um, uh, maybe, oh, it's right in that bell again, right? Rin, Rin. Okay, okay, welcome to Soup Mo, where soup is just, oh, it's you. This better be important, McFly. Please, <laughs> was that Jennifer? Well, hey. It's none of your business. And B, seeing as she ain't your chick no more? Yeah. Okay, now this timeline is really pissing me off. <laughs> you and Jennifer? Really? Oh, is the poor little nerd jealous? Well, yeah, and a little disgusted. That's probably the soup. 
Um, okay, don't worry, I'm going to fix the timeline. Yes, I will fix it. You better treat Jen with respect, Leech. Hey, I got nothing but respect for Jennifer. Respect for her eyes, for her hips, the way she wriggles when she... Hey! Now, that dork that let her get away, there's a loser that I got no respect for. Rude. Rude, rude, rude. Where are the free samples? Here. I keep them behind the counter. Oh, God. If you puke, you're cleaning it up, wuss. I, I can't finish this. Not they my don't problem. Look that nice. Um. Why are the samples behind the counter? I can't leave them out, dude. There's a DOG running around town, and he keeps going after the sample tray, knocking them all over the ground. A dog? Wait, these samples haven't been on the ground, have they? Jeez, McFly, relax. They're fresh, mostly. Yes, where's, where's Einstein? About this dog, I need him to get trouble like? again. Beats me. He's a smart little SOB. He only comes around when my back is turned. Then how do you know it's a dog? You can smell him? Allergies, dimwit. <laughs> what are those things? Those are the liver and peas with soy cheese hot dogs. Ew. You and me both, brown noser. Okay, yeah. Um, what's on the menu? What's on uh, the menu? Soup. Just soup? And more. <laughs> what kind of soup you got? Uh, scrolle... Rivellini? Yeah, that's right. Some things never change. <laughs> what falls under the more category? We got neat loaf. It's made with textured wheat protein. Uh, no thanks. Sounds, uh, really, really, uh, uh, nice. <laughs> What's on the menu? What's on the menu? Soup. Just soup? Oh, yeah, I've said that already, yeah. Um, what sort of sneeze? You got a cold or something? Ugh, it's allergies. I swear, there's a dog hanging out around here somewhere. A dog? So he's yeah. close. The, the dog stupid is stupid mutt keeps trying to steal my free samples. Right, okay. See ya. Smell you later. <gasps> he left him out here. Even screwed up not so Hill Valley doesn't deserve that smell. He's left him out here. There he is. He's got face masks. Hey! Oh. Where's that mangy? Where's oh. face mask Go get him, McFly! Sure, I'll catch him. Oh, he's taking the sample then. Great. Oh, there he is. Right. Go catch. Oh. She left some paint. Okay, I'll deal with the paint later. I've got to deal with the dog. Um, go over. He's got to be hiding in here somewhere. Oh, so I've got to pick some places. Right, we've got the pallet. We've got the fridge. And we've got the table. Hmm. Can you tell me if he's behind the table? <laughs> I can't see. I'm just going to click the fridge. Stay put now, God. boy. He's not Wherever behind the fridge. Oh, he was behind the bloody not a sign thing. Of him. He's gone that way now. Oh, and I magically appeared here. Okay. Uh, grab the paint. I My took nothing. Oh. No, <laughs> I didn't take it. Dork. Oh shush. Where's that dog gone? That oh, he's there. All right. No, don't walk that way. No, no, no. Okay. Go back over here. There he is. Again. Right, can I get, can I get the spray spray paint? Yeah. 
You and Leech, Jennifer? Hey, don't badmouth Leech. There's a lot more to him than soup, you know. Like what? For one thing, he wields an axe like nobody's business. So you got yourself a new guitar player. What can I say? I'm a girl who appreciates a hot lick. Yeah, I remember. Come on, Jennifer. Nobody in town plays guitar like me. I'm talking electric guitar, Martin. I'm gonna be honest, the ukulele has to go. <laughs> I can outplay your loser boyfriend any day of the week. You're that desperate to get to first base. Did you say first or fourth? I'd give you two and a half. But first you gotta prove you've got better fingers than Leech. You ready to throw down? I was born ready. Uh, well, you got we, a guitar? You have to have a... Never leave home without a guitar hero bustle. On. Oh, God. I'm gonna lose. You can knock on my door anytime. Hold it, we got company. I mean, McFly. I'm not sure if I What's can that was doing here? He I'm says he can outplay you. I told him, there's no one in Hill Valley better than you. Wanna go prove it? The Ring of Rock? <laughs> Don't crush him too bad. Just teach him a lesson. Okay, what do I do? Move towards Jennifer. Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay, well, this is interesting. Oh, that's a wobbly plank. Right. So I have to make him make him do something. Give up. No, I'm not giving up. Right, so until I do something, he copies. He's, he's taking a leap. Okay. Um, move towards... He's moving back again. I don't understand it. Okay, now we swapped sides now. So uh, do I have to make him go on there? Let's flourish. Well, you cut my cord, you asshole! Somebody oh, no. should have cut it a long time ago, McFly. The winner and undefeated champion of Hill Valley. Claim your prize, champ. He cheated. I didn't even figure out what I was supposed to do. Well, back to work. See you, loser. I can't believe you'd let him get away with that. He totally broke the rules. There are no rules in rock and roll, Martin. That's why a guy like you shouldn't compete. Do you know what? Do you know, what? I was going to end the video, but, you know, I'm, I'm going to try that again if I can. Can I try that again? Can we try again, please? Yeah? I want Try a rematch. Again. Ooh, you got nerve, McFly. You really want to be humiliated? Yes, yes. Stop the chit chat. Let's do it. Okay. I can do this again. I already swatted you once, McFly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What 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 Try not to leave any scars, baby. Okay, right. So, this one's Jennifer.
Okay, so... Do I have to keep hopping? Will that break eventually? No, he's coming back down again. What do I have to do? Oh, I know. No, I don't really, but... Okay. Move to the left. Okay, let's go back. No idea why, but... Okay, now I climb on a platform again. Hopefully I'll go on the other side. I don't know. Climb on platform. No, I'm going in the side. I'm confused. Now he's coming back down. I'm confused. Do I have to get to his side? Because I'm not sure. I was going to cut my cord again, didn't I? I did that again. What? I'm so confused. Hey, you were looking for a fight. We just had one. I beat you. Again. Hmm. Well, that was fun. I'll see you later. Love is a battlefield. Yeah, okay, I'm confused. Um, but I'm gonna end this video here. Um, I'm going to try that again in the next video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, watching me lose. Um, I'm going to research this because I have no idea. Like, I think I'm supposed to make him fall in that in that uh, trash can, but I I don't know how to do that. Um, oh, I just had an idea actually. But no, um, I'm going to try that in the next video. Um, hope you enjoyed, uh, you know what to do, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video, um, yeah, bye bye for now.